pertandingan semakin hangat apabila peserta top 12 One in a Million bertanding untuk menjadi peserta kegemaran anda. Some did well in impressing the judges. That was outstanding, that song choice. Thank you. The biggest mistake I did was not to pay enough attention to you because you're an, an amazing talent. Others are still reeling from their comments. I can panggil you Kang Kang King lah you. If you don't give us something incredible, then Malaysians won't vote for you. Undian anda akan menentukan siapakah yang akan layak tinggal dalam pertandingan ini dan siapa pula yang akan tersingkir. Selamat malam Malaysia, selamat menyaksikan One in a Million. Hello. Saya Awal Ashari. Saya Awal Ashari. And I'm Marian Conter. And please give it up for our judges, Pomos and Shafinas. Shafinas, you're looking absolutely stunning Gorgeous. tonight. Gorgeous. Paul, nice shirt. <laughs> Zebra shirt, eh? <laughs> Anyways, Malaysia, the voting lines are now closed. Who will be voted out this week and who will have the highest number of votes in to receive immunity from being voted out? That's right. Nampaknya talian undian telah pun ditutup. Terima kasih di atas undian anda atas pilihan top 12 kami. Tetapi, malam ini impian dua peserta untuk memenangi hadiah satu juta ringgit akan berakhir. Exactly. But remember, the contestant who has the highest number of votes in will have immunity from being eliminated even if he or she has the highest number of votes out. Contestants, when I call your names, please come to center stage. All right. Alia. Far. Farah Mimi Itu dia. Di atas pentas ini ialah enam peserta yang ada dan malam ini kita akan menghantar dua daripada mereka pulang. Tapi sebelum itu kita akan umumkan peserta yang mendapat undian paling tinggi oleh anda rakyat Malaysia ialah. Immunity this week goes to. Suki! Suki, congratulations! You have the highest number of votes in. You may join the rest over there, Suki. Tahniah, Suki. Dan mereka yang berada bersama Suki juga tahniah kerana anda turut kekal The One in a Million. Good job, guys, over there. But for the five of you remaining on stage right now, the five of you are in the bottom five. And this is based on the SMS results. And we all know that two of you here will be going home tonight. When I call your names, please come forward. Asfar. Farah. Baiklah Malaysia. Asfa dan juga Farah. Anda semua sudah maklum yang anda sekarang berada di bottom five. Dan ini bermakna sokongan rakyat Malaysia terhadap anda agak berkurangan. Dan mulai malam ini, anda perlu berusaha dengan lebih gigih lagi kerana anda kekal di One in a Million. Congratulations, Asfa, Farah. Please join the 
Thank the rest of them over there. Baiklah, sekarang kita ada. Okay. Alia, Mimi, dan juga Annie. We're down to our bottom three. And we all know only one of you here will still be in the running for one million ringgit, which of course means two of you will have to leave the competition tonight. Baiklah, anda semua sudah bersedia? Sudah bersedia? Alia, sila tampil ke hadapan. Alia, mulai malam ini, anda perlu bersedia dengan lagu yang seterusnya kerana anda kekal di One in a Million. Malaysia, you have voted out Mimi and Annie. Sorry guys. Congratulations, Alia. Bala Malaysia, anda, anda yang menentukan kedudukan mereka. Jadi jika anda tidak ingin perkara yang sama berulang kembali, apa yang anda perlu lakukan, hantar sebanyak mungkin undian anda bagi memastikan peserta favorit anda terus kekal di One in a Million dan seterusnya menggapai impian untuk memenangi satu juta ringgit. Exactly, but if you didn't like what you just saw Malaysia, then you know what to do. You have to go to ensure that your favorite contestant continues in the competition. Okay, because their survival lies in your hands now. Tapi sebelum kita berehat seketika, apa kata kita berikan tepukan yang paling gemuruh untuk Annie dan juga Mimi. Give it up one more time. You guys rock. You guys were amazing, okay? And all the best. We're going to take a short break, Malaysia, but when we come back, the competition heats up as the remaining 10 finalists do their thing on stage as they continue on that journey and one in a million. We'll be back. Welcome back to One in a Million. Yay! Okay, and please everyone give it up for our guest judge today, Mr. Zainal Alam Kader. Yay! How you doing? I'm okay. Okay. Okay, untuk pengetahuan anda, Encik Zainal Alam Kader adalah orang yang tidak asing lagi dalam dunia hiburan. Beliau merupakan naib presiden untuk Persatuan Wartawan dan Penulis Hiburan Malaysia dan beliau juga telah lama berkecimpung dalam penulisan dan juga pengkritikan muzik. Exactly, he's a jack of all trades. He's Thank a man. you. Thank you. Yeah. He's a man. Thanks for joining us today. Thank you for having me here. Our okay, Zainal Alam Kade. Okay. Mungkin ada apa-apa yang nak dikomen tentang penyingkiran sebentar tadi. And Paul Shafinas. Do you saya rasa sebab saya tengok minggu lepas, performance minggu lepas saya tengok dan saya rasa memang tak di apa bukan tak disangka. Memang uh, ada banyak kelemahan kat pada dewan dan mungkin penonton juga uh, menyaksikan benda yang sama jadi dia dah buat pilihan. Itu je. Alright. Shafinas, Paul. Are you surprised? Did you expect the results? I I I think what we're seeing is um who, who, who is actually delivering something that's relevant now? It's, it's interesting to also see Alia in, in that bottom three. All of those are sort of traditional, singing traditional sort of Malay ballads, older Malay songs, older, older stylings. And I think perhaps our voters just don't want to see that. All right. Okay. Jadi kalau minggu lepas, kesemua peserta kita perlu menghadapi dua cabaran yang amat susah. Minggu ini juga mereka diberikan dua lagi cabaran yang berbeza. Dan satu daripadanya ialah mereka telah pun diber, diberi lagu pilihan judges kami. Hmm. Saksikan. This week is a judges choice which means that Shafinaz and I have actually selected the songs for them to sing. What we've done is to choose songs which we feel will test them and and stretch them a little bit in areas where we feel they're a little bit weak or perhaps they haven't delivered what they need to for each of their brands. Misalnya mungkin kita pilih sesebuah lagu itu sebab kita nak penyanyi itu atau peserta itu menyampaikannya dengan lebih banyak emosi atau emosi yang lebih mendalam. Ataupun uh, lagu itu dipilih kerana kami ingin melihat lebih banyak interaksi antara peserta dan juga penonton. Ataupun kami ingin melihat sama ada peserta itu boleh menjadikan lagu itu uh, milik mereka sendiri ataupun uh, peserta itu uh, boleh menjadikan sesebuah lagu lama lebih relevan dengan muzik masa kini. Okay. Wow. Well, that was their first task. But the second task that the contestants have to fulfill is media grooming. What exactly is media grooming? Let's what find out. What is media grooming? Welcome to the New Six Time Press, Malaysia Berhad. 
and welcome to Haram and Chokin. Media grooming ataupun pengandaman media melibatkan peserta-peserta One in a Million mempelajari cara mengendalikan diri semasa press conference dan hal-hal yang melibatkan wartawan dan media. Ning Baizura juga dijemput berkongsi pengalaman sebagai seorang artis yang sudah biasa dengan situasi sebegini. Sejurus selepas itu, sebuah ujian sidang media diadakan untuk membiasakan peserta-peserta dalam aspek ini. Dan malam ini pertandingan akan dimulakan dengan peserta top 10 yang mendapat undian paling banyak oleh anda Malaysia. Silakan Suki. I think my my market is quite um it's quite large because I know how to sing Cantonese song, I know how to sing uh, Malay song, I know how to sing English song. So kalau boleh tiga-tiga nak. I memang ada compose for Taiwan artists. So I hope one day I can sing my own song. I can boleh berkembang dalam pasaran Taiwan nanti. So Malaysia for sure, Malay song, I mean nak juga. The judges ranked her number one in the top 20. She was then eliminated in the knockout rounds, but you Malaysia gave her a second chance and immunity this week. Singing Alanis Morissette's You Ought to Know, give it up for Suki. diberikan immunity itu pada minggu hadapan ya kerana memang sebenarnya anda saya tak rasa anda akan dibuang pun minggu hadapan kerana performance hari ini memang sungguh bertenaga memang baik <tuk> tapi hati-hati dengan tempo kat tengah tangan tadi maybe because you couldn't hear yourself ke orang begitu kuat menjerit untuk anda kadang-kadang anda kurang dengar dan you, you are a little bit off ya tempo um, but I love your lower notes when you first started sungguh sedap, sedap merdu suara Suki I love it Good. Um, hi Suki. Saya rasa kelebihan Suki uh, bila saya tengok balik uh, fit, uh, playback tentang uh, masa interview dengan Haram Metro tadi. Saya rasa kelebihan Suki ialah Suki selesa dengan diri sendiri. Selus, uh, Suki juga ada keyakinan dan uh, itu juga kita nampak press conference tu sebenarnya macam performance juga. Uh, untuk menghadapi penonton dan juga menghadapi press tu lebih kurang sama Jadi Suki nampaknya relax Dan Suki rasa selesa dan juga yakin dengan performance Suki Jadi itu yang kita nampak hari ini dan mungkin sebab tu Semua orang pun rasa dan memberikan Suki sokongan, betul tak? Senyap je semua so. Thank you I, I, You know what I like? 
Every week we see you becoming more and more of a star, don't we? You know, the hair is different now. I think you actually like all of this attention, don't you? Um, which is a good thing. It's a really great thing. That's what we want. I want to, see, I want to find a star. Um, you handled, as everyone has noted, that was a very difficult song choice in the beginning because it starts really low, and you handled that really well. We wanted to see you um, do a little bit more of a meteor song. You know, the songs you've done before have been a bit more lightweight and poppy, and you really delivered on our test. That was excellent. I loved it. Thank you. Wow, there you have it, Suki, the first contestant of the night, and rave review from the judges. Good job, Suki. Thank you. Well, Malaysia, you seem to love her because you keep voting for her. And if you still love her, then you know what to do. Vote her in. You can do so by SMSing in space Suki to 32728 or dial 13725 from your landline. But if you really don't want her to continue, you can also vote her out. Just SMS out space Suki to 32728 or dial 13726 from your landline. Remember, we need your votes at the end of the show tonight. Cita-cita untuk meneruskan pelajaran ataupun memang concentrate on music je and then see what happens. Saya rasa pelajaran tu penting. Memang saya saya ada fikir pasal tu. Memang saya akan sambung belajar. Uh, tapi kalau saya punya peluang lebih luas, saya akan terus dengan peluang saya. But if like saya punya album memang jatuh, memang tak ada orang nak beli langsung. Dan saya, ya saya akan sambung belajar. Saya pun ada sijil. So uh, saya akan terus menjadi apa yang saya belajar sebelum ini. Bagi seseorang yang cuma hanya, hanya hafal dua lagu saja semasa sesi audition dulu, kini beliau melangkah jauh di dalam pertandingan ini. Tetapi bolehkah beliau mara ke peringkat yang seterusnya? Anda tentukan. Menyanyikan lagu hits OAG berjudul Generasiku, berikan tepukan yang gemuruh buat Lokman. Lagi terjaga ku dari mimpi terasa hati senang sekali pasti dunia ku yang punya di hari ini bersama kawan-kawan ku pergi ke tawar yang senang hati indahnya dunia ketika kita muda maja segalanya dalam genggaman walau apapun takkan menjadi halangan hidup ini setia menanti Bersinar pagar mentari Jangan gentar mengejar mimpi Yakin berani percaya diri Dan mulakan dengan hello Jangan takut jatuh ke bumi Pikas bangun melangkah lagi ke depan lari Dan terbang menuju bintang Hanya kau saja yang dapat menuntut Sebab utama kami beri lagu ini kepada Lukman adalah sebab kita nak tengok interaction Lukman dengan audience. Ya, kerana Luk, kita tahu Lukman dari mula dulu memang pemalu sangat. Tengok kaki lah, tengok lantai lah. Hari ini, at least saya nampak anda ada interaksi dengan audience. Ya, walau bagaimanapun, bila dah sampai tengah-tengah jalan tu, you lupa, you basuh balik dalam alam you sendiri, you lupa dengan audience you. Ya, jangan asyik pejam mata aja. Okay, bila mula-mula dah start, you dah interact dengan orang, keep on doing that. And kalaupun anda tak suka sesebuah lagu, anda harus ingat sebagai penyanyi ada kalanya kita kena nyanyi lagu yang kita tak suka. So it's up to you to make the audience like the song. Terima kasih. Okay. Hello man. Okay. 
Lokman ada satu uh, nak sebut perkataan orang ni geli sikit lah satu aura yang selamba maksudnya mungkin Lokman nak cuba tunjulkan image yang lebih selamba, lebih relax, lebih apa tapi daripada kita tengok yang masa Lokman menangani orang-orang press tadi uh, keselambaan Lokman tu mungkin boleh menjadi satu perangkap sebenarnya kena sebab ni one in a million jika anda tidak tunjukkan yang anda betul-betul mahukan satu juta tidak perlu bertanding tapi sekarang ni satu pertandingan tapi Lokman sebenarnya ada kelebihan yang Lokman sendiri belum tahu saya rasa kalau minggu-minggu akan datang bila Lokman kalau ada lagi masa di one in a million Lokman kena tunjukkan lebih uh, jangan selamba sangat dan cuba um, connect dengan audience semua ok terima kasih alright ok Lokman <coughs> Yeah, we, we gave you the song because we wanted to give you something that would bring you to life. So far, you've just been so relaxed, you've almost been horizontal. Um, and it really, it, it didn't work. It, it, I would say the song actually killed you. There was plenty of opportunity. No one is more slumber and relaxed than Ruddy OAG, and yet he can make it work, and you couldn't. Okay? You couldn't even find a way of doing the song that would work for you, not at all. Lacked any sort of intensity, the verse was lame, and the chorus just got lamer. It was a disaster for you. I think you'll be going home to join your friends. And, and seriously, it looks like you, you don't want to be here. Thank you, boss. Thank you. Thank you, judges. Baiklah, jika anda inginkan Lokman ke peringkat top 9, undian untuk Lokman, taip masuk jarak Lokman dan hantarkan ke 32728 ataupun anda boleh mendal terus talian tetap anda. Taliannya ialah 13725. Jika anda rasakan yang Lokman tidak layak untuk ke top 9, hantarkan undian keluar jarak Lokman dan hantarkan ke 32728 ataupun boleh dial 13726 daripada talian tetap anda. Ingat, anda, anda hanya boleh mengundi di penghujung rancangan nanti. Our next contestant has been given the opportunity by the judges to expand his style. Will he deliver? You decide after the break. Welcome back to One in a Million. Now here's a quick peek at how our next contestant did during his media grooming session. Uh, as far as Setiap tahun uh, kita melahirkan bakat-bakat baru dan muncul dengan album. Uh, tapi keadaan industri kita ni agak lembab. Jualan album susah nak, nak jual. Jadi dengan keadaan album baru ni, anda yakin ke album tu akan dapat sambutan? Pada saya, uh, kepentingan ataupun kualiti sesebuah lagu pada saya adalah satu perkara yang saya pandang tinggi dan memang saya pentingkan kualiti sebelum ini. So kalau nak dikatakan uh, sebagai apa? Uh, laku ataupun tidak kita kena cuba ataupun kita kena ada satu eksperimentasi lah terhadap apa jua bidang sekalipun Minggu lepas para judges memuji persembahan beliau tetapi undian daripada anda telah meletakkan beliau di bottom 5 dan minggu ini beliau ingin menebus kembali kekalahan tersebut dengan menyanyikan lagu manis dendangan Zainal Abidin Terimalah Asfar Manis puluti bibi Sangatlah berbahaya Sama-sama yang menyindir Selalunya Bukalah matamu percaya
Thank you. Thank you. Oh, jadi sekarang saya tahu kenapa kamu pakai topi tu. Yeah. Tadi saya tertanya-tanya kenapa budak ni pakai topi. Rupanya dia nak pusing kan? Oh. Yes. Okay. Alright, uh, Asfar. Uh, saya rasa anda kreatif. Ada sedikit perbezaan melodi di sana yang anda cuba untuk menjadi kreatif. Uh, tetapi was a little bit pitchy in the beginning. Yeah. Uh, and also you've got this very weird posture lah bila menyanyi. Macam ni, macam ni. Kenapa eh? Dan juga saya rasa anda masih mencari-cari imej yang sesuai untuk anda. Betul? Uh, saya nak kata betul pun tak juga sebab uh, lagu saya ingin kenakan dengan lagu lah. Lagu tu mau to scar. Tak kena pun? Eh, tak kena ke? Hmm. Dia rasa macam dia kena tak? <laughs> Thank you, Malaysia. Okay, nasib anda baik orang jawab kena. Walau macam mana pun, when you sing this song, I rasa you have to have a little bit more attitude. Tadi yeah. lembut sangat lah. Eh? Okay. Okay, but it's okay. Thank you. Uh, sebelum apa-apa, bagi tepukan kepada Asfa. Sebab, sebab dia berani dan dia menjawab dan dia beri jawapan yang bukan menyakit hati tapi jawapan yang kelakar. He's, a, he's got a good sense of humor. Maknanya dia seorang pe, apa, performer yang bagus Maknanya dia tahu apa yang dia boleh buat Apa yang tak boleh buat Jadi Asfa Saya saya tak ada masalah dengan Asfa Sebab saya rasa Asfa ada keyakinan yang cukup Dan cara jawapan Asfa dengan nama press pun bagus Cuma satu je Asfa Masalah saya dengan topi itu juga Tanggalkan please Thank you oh, okay. uh, Well, He's got a sense of humor Yeah but I don't think we're looking for new performers for scenario yeah. That's what it looked like to me It's okay, it's okay. That's exactly what it was like, okay? I mean, it, I thought it was a lame sing-along version of the song. I, I don't think it showed what you can do with your voice or the brand that you've showed us before. I think it was something completely different. And, I, and you're right, it was yeah. comical. Yeah. It was funny. Thank you. Thank you, judges. Untuk melihat Asfa terus kekal di One in a Million minggu hadapan, saya masuk jarak Asfa dan hantarkan ke 32728. Anda juga boleh terus mengundi dal daripada talian tetap anda. Taliannya ialah 13725. Untuk mengundi keluar, type keluar jarak Asfa dan hantarkan ke 32728 ataupun boleh dal 13726 daripada talian tetap anda. Okey, nampaknya Asfa sudah pun selesai membuat persembahan. Peserta yang seterusnya ialah Zai dan beliau akan menyampaikan sebuah lagu dendangan kumpulan Aerosmith. Hmm. Untuk mengetahui sejauh mana kehebatan Zai, sama-sama kita Kalau saksikan. Kalau awak nak terus baca fokus, masalahnya awak dah pun muncul dengan album baru. Kenapa awak nak mensiap, mempersiapkan dia awak dengan belajar fokus dulu sebelum keluar dengan album? Saya memang dari kecil dah ada talent untuk nyanyi. So, memang saya tak pernah pergi belajar fokus pun saya dah boleh nyanyi. Tapi, sekarang ni saya rasa... Uh, sesiapa pun kalau dah jadi profesional artis artis atau singer pun kita masih boleh belajar banyak lagi tentang vokal. It's not uh, setakat tu je kan. Uh, so saya rasa saya boleh improve lagi lah. Saya lebih baik lagi. Kalau ada album lagi ke, uh, boleh lagi baik lagi. Macam tu lah. She has always won the hearts of the audience with every performance right here. But will she win the competition with your votes, Malaysia? Give it up everyone for Zai! Stay awake just to hear you breathing. Watch you smile while you are sleeping, while you're far away and dreaming. I could spend my life in this sweet surrender. I could stay lost in this moment forever.
okay, 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 okay. Relax, relax. Zai, satu nasihat saya bila tengok you punya VT tadi jadi penyanyi ni, suara mesti ada tapi otak pun mesti ada juga ya. Okay. Ah, uh, you started off really shaky. Mungkin you tak dengar agaknya kot ya. Kuat ya. Mama dah tak dengar. Tak dengar. Okey, salahkan dia orang. Ya. Yeah. Tapi saya rasa memang dari segi suara anda memang mempunyai banyak potensi, Zai. Memang banyak potensi. Ya. Yeah. Walau macam mana pun you must, you mesti, you mesti jaga you punya pitch, you mesti ada listening skill. Yeah. Alright. Saya tahu kadang-kadang bila kuat macam ni you tak dengar tapi terpaksalah nak buat yeah. macam mana. Yeah. Okay. And Also Zai, bila you menyanyi tu, cuba jangan dongak sangat, asyik tengok you punya leher je, tak seronok lah. Okay. okay? Try and keep your eye level dengan audience. Okay? Jangan asyik tengok apa you tengok kat atas tu, I pun tak tahu. Ya? Yeah? Hmm. Kalau degil lain kali, ni jawapan dia. Ketawa je Zai, ketawa je. Ketawa je. Ketawa Because ni. that's your ability. Yang penting saya rasa Zai ni disayangi kawan-kawan kan? Mesti ramai kawan-kawan suka dia. Sebab saya rasa dia macam kalau orang, orang Johor, orang kampung saya, macam saya ni cakap, uh, macam Ibu Keladi kan. Ibu Keladi yang ramai orang keliling, yeah. macam kalau dia, dia buat lawak semua ketawa kan. Jadi personality you tu sebenarnya yang memenangi jiwa orang ramai. Jadi awak jangan risau. Awak jangan risau pasal saiz ke apa benda, personality awak tu dah besar. Don't worry about anything else. So uh, keep on singing dan insya Allah kalau Zai berjaya, okey lah tu. Okey, terima kasih. So we, we, why we chose this song, was we, we actually wanted to see you interpret a song um, to take advantage of your strong, soulful voice. Actually, it was an inspired song choice by our head of brand management for uh, Irene Zainal. Thanks, Irene. Um, but instead, we got a country and western ballad. I don't think you showed the strength of your voice. I don't think you, you know, once or twice maybe. Um, your strength is in this power and the soul. Without it, to be perfectly honest, You're a big girl taking up a lot of room on stage and you won't go far. And I tell you what, you will be missing something. You'll be missing a chance at a million ringgit if you don't improve. You've got to deliver your voice every time. Okay, thank you judges. Interesting comments. Chafinas, I got to say, you look even more stunning with that rotan. Oh. <laughs> But you know what? Again, Zai, you've done it. You've impressed everyone here in the in the studio audience. But you know, you Malaysia at home, you're equally impressed and you know what to do. You have to vote to ensure that she continues on the competition. To do so, you can vote, type in space Zai and send it to 32728 or dial 13725 from your landline. But if you don't feel she should continue, you can vote her out. Just type out space Zai and send it to 32728. Or you can also dial 13726 from your landline. Remember, voting starts at the end of tonight's show. Selamat kembali menyaksikan One in a Million yang dipancarkan secara live dari Sri Pentas 2 Shah Alam dan Marian kita ada dua lagi peserta. That's right. Our next contestant had to answer a very important question to the reporters. I bet you didn't know this. Take a look. Boleh saya pergi contoh macam uh, dari negara luar Bobais dengan uh, yang baru lepas ni Chris. Uh, Dua-dua dah berkahwin dah ada anak dan diorang macam sangat pergi jauh dan saya rasa saya ambil iktibar di situ yang sebenarnya pendengar-pendengar atau peminat muzik kat Malaysia ni perlu ada mentaliti sebegitu. Being married and having uh, a son akan menjatuhkan saya punya popularity kot. As long as what you deliver and how you look after your image is oh, good. Yes. Masa ni kita tak nak minat awal, kita 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 He showed you and the judges that he has strong desire to win this competition. With a little help from friends, he just might. Give it up for Faisal! What would you do if I sang out of tune? Would you stand up and walk out on me? Lend me your ears and I'll sing you a song. I will try not to sing out of key I'll get it by with a little help I just keep on trying with a little help Yeah, I want to get high Yeah, and I just hold on to my prayers All right now, oh, here we go Love 
Faizal, saya kena beritahu lah sebenarnya memang anda adalah antara peserta yang saya tunggu-tunggu tunggu-tunggu untuk menerima. Thank you. Karena saya rasa anda betul-betul inginkan ini dan anda you put yourself into the music, ya? Yeah? Dan um, okay, you change the melody here and there. It shows your creativity. All right, you play with, yeah. Oh, yeah. It was a completely different interpretation. Of, have it's you okay. ever heard the song know. before? It's a, I've heard it before, but to me it's okay. Yeah, yeah. You can sing it. Well, the first few, the first few bars, you kept the melody. After that, you took off. So what? You know, it's your interpretation. Every single singer has got a different interpretation. So it's okay, yeah. I must say I like the vocal arrangements. I don't care what other people say. I like it. Thank yeah. you very much. Ah, sebelum saya lupa, saya nak cakap dengan you. Saya rasa reporter tadi tu suka kat you lah. Okay, Paul will have his turn kejap lagi, but this is my turn. Um, Faisal, what I appreciate most about you is your willingness. Untuk buat lebih dari apa yang patut Untuk memenangi one in a million ni Untuk memenangi satu juta ringgit Saya faham tu Tapi kadang-kadang uh, Bila uh, Sebab kita dah biasa tengok performance Dan kadang-kadang uh, Ada benda yang terlalu kalkulatif Yang orang akan tangkap Maknanya Tak semua benda tentang matematik Dua campur dua empat uh, Soalan yang begini Jawapannya begini Kalau aku uh, Berslide ke depan Orang akan jerit Macam di, macam dia tahu-tahu Um, bila you buat macam tu, predictability dia, level dia semakin tinggi Maknanya, try to be more spontaneous, jangan plan sangat Dan uh, sebab awak ada suara dan awak ada akal yang lebih sikit daripada orang lain, saya tahu Tapi, um, jangan kakli tu sangat sure. Just be spontaneous Thank you, thank you very much uh. No, no, because because that was an excellent original interpretation of that song Okay, thank you, you Did, did Did anyone else know that the original was was by the Beatles, sung by Ringo Starr? Was it like that? No. Was it like the Joe Cocker version? No, it wasn't. It was completely original. It, you made it yours. I think that the, the stage movements, I mean, okay, sure, you'd worked out what you were going to do. But when it came to the actual performance, you just, you just let go and you did it. The way that you felt like doing it right at that moment. And I think that's the thing that really worked. The best thing, what you're doing, okay, is you're combining what I call competition elements, things that are going to really work for you in this show, with, with things that are going to work in the real world, that people want to see when they go to a concert to see Faisal. Okay? And that is brilliant. It's going to take you a long way. Thank you very much. Thank you. Wow. Thank you, judges. Okay, well, if you believe that Faisal has what it takes, To win the one million ringgit cash prize, then you have to vote him in. Okay, just type in Space Faisal and send it to three two seven two eight or dot one three seven two five from your landline. But if you don't think he has what it takes, you can vote him out. Just type out Space Faisal and send it to three two seven two eight or dot one three seven two six from your landline. Voting will begin at the end of tonight's show, which is very very soon. Dan peserta kita yang seterusnya mempunyai penampilan yang tersendiri ketika membuat persembahan di atas pentas walaupun baru berusia 16 tahun. Tetapi bagaimana agaknya beliau memberikan reaksi kepada wartawan? Saksikan. Jadi apa hubungan awak dengan Alisa? Alisa? Hubungan saya sebagai kawan sebenarnya. <laughs> Tapi um, tak salah saya sebab sebelum ini Alisa beri kenyataan bahawa dia memang dan awak punya hubungan istimewa. Hubungan yang istimewa kan? Sebenarnya tak ada lah. Mungkin kawan rapat je. Saya kenal-kenal je. Kawan-kawan keluar habis je lah. Habis takkan dia menipu pihak media sekarang ni. Dia kata dia memang awak punya hubungan istimewa. Kenapa awak mesti menafikan? Mungkin kepada saya, saya nampak macam kawan dia. Kepada dia, saya rasa saya ni istimewa kepada dia. Tak tahu mungkin. Awak suka mempermain dengan perempuan? He's had the love of his family since day one of the competition. And now to win your support, Malaysia, here's Alif with Mama Tolong Perjaya. <laughs> Give it up! Ampunian mentari limau menderin Terpulang pada cermin kanta kita Dan bagaimana kita melihat Awan rumput bunga Pemimpin tega, mata bukanlah hati 
authority untuk menentukan hakikat ah, kami dasar betapa pinya mendeka kepada kami mama jangan Agaknya you suka eh, I panggil you Kang Kang King last week eh. <laughs> Is that your trademark? You're going to Kang Kang here and Kang Kang there, yeah. right? Oh, alright. Okay, um, saya rasa ini makanan Alif lah. Yeah, and it shows when you like a song. Kita boleh nampak? Saya rasa anda memang suka lagu ini, betul tak? Yes. Yeah, dan saya boleh nampak itu dari anda. Dan saya rasa anda satu-satunya yang berani untuk letak satu prop di belakang itu, berbeza. Ya. Yeah. Um, tapi saya rasa anda perlu relax sikit lah. Lift kadang-kadang nampak macam so tense. Yeah? Like okay, you, okay. you were trying too hard. Relax yeah. sikit. Okay? Okay. okay. Um, okay. Alif. Alif yes. dia tiba. <laughs> Then, um, cara you sebenarnya saya rasa memang mudah disenangi orang ramai. Kau tengok perempuan-perempuan menjerit kat you kan? <laughs> ha, that's an example. Saya tak kisah saya, nak, saya, saya tak boleh komen sangat pasal suara, pasal uh, personality. Uh, cuma saya rasa yang saya nak tengok sekarang dalam masa 2 tahun selepas Alif buka braces. Dah ada orang terjongking. Kalau Alif buka braces dalam masa 2 tahun lagi, apa agaknya uh, yang akan berlaku pada Alif dalam dunia seni dan itu saya rasa tak sabar tak tengok. Okey. You you. Tak, tak, tak. Maksud saya bukan pasal dia ada braces ada masalah. Maksudnya bila dia dah dewasa sedikit daripada sekarang, ah. kalau ini efek yang dia boleh bagi kepada orang ramai, apa lagi dalam masa 2 tahun bila dia lebih matang ah. dan lebih dewasa di atas pentas. Ah. Betul. Okey. Pardon me, Alif. You know like It, it would have been great at the high school idol contest, but nah, not for this. So I don't think. See, what I don't like is you're not growing into the star that I sort of hoped you would. You're not really commanding the thing. You're sort of just looking like a young kid going through the motions. It, it looks like it's a stage too far for you. And I, I, honestly, the nicest thing I can say is I don't think that you'll be getting immunity from the no, most number of votes for for this week. Thank you. Thank you, judges. Okay. Our final contestant of the night, Alif. Malam Malaysia, jika anda ingin lihat lagi kangkang king kita beraksi minggu depan, jangan lupa hantarkan undian untuk Alif. Tak masuk jarak Alif dan hantarkan ke 32728 ataupun anda boleh dial terus 13725 daripada talian tetap anda. Untuk mengundi keluar, type keluar jarak satu jarak Alif dan hantarkan ke 32728 ataupun boleh type kelu, boleh dial terus 13726 daripada talian tetap anda dan talian akan dibuka sebentar saja lagi. Exactly, the voting lines will be open very very soon. Dan sekarang apa kata kita imbas kembali ke semua 10 peserta kita malam ini. And here's a reminder of the voting instructions.
Itu dia. Berikan tepukan untuk 10 peserta kami. Dan yeah. ingat, ingat mereka memerlukan undian daripada anda semua. Ya, yeah, they've done their very best to impress impress you, Malaysia, everyone. Okay, at home. So, it's up to you to decide who stays and who goes. Dan sekarang tugas anda, Rakyat Malaysia, untuk terus mengundi untuk memastikan peserta favorit anda memenangi hadiah satu juta ringgit. That's a lot of money. You can now begin to vote Malaysia, but we just want to remind you guys, okay, that the immunity that Suki received today will not save her from next week competition. From the competition next week. Yes, that's right. Dan untuk memastikan peserta favorit anda mendapat immunity, anda perlu mengundi, mengundi dan terus mengundi dan menjadikan beliau peserta yang paling mendapat banyak Undian. Correct. Okay lah. Dan esok anda boleh berjumpa dengan semua sepuluh peserta One in a Million di Bukit Jalil, di pusat sukan Bukit Jalil jam 2 petang bertempat di Booth BHP. Cool. Uh. They're also going to be at TMNet in Cyberjaya on the 3rd of August for a meet the fan session and a photo session. You do not want to miss that, okay? Dan jangan lupa saksikan Diary One in a Million yang akan kudara setiap hari Rabu jam 9.30 malam hanya di ATV. Dan dengan itu, saya Awal Ashari. And I'm Marian Conte and this has been...